We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. Nicki Minaj, I don't know if y'all heard Nicki Minaj got arrested uh, over uh, overseas, over the pond. Know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Uh, it was, uh, if I'm not mistaken, it was at Amsterdam. You know what I'm saying? They said they found what they call soft drugs, a.k.a. Uh, marijuana. You know what I'm saying? Mary Jane. You feel me? Uh, she was locked up for five to six hours. Anyways, uh, according to her, you know what I mean? They, uh, she's saying that they basically trying to sabotage her tour. Um. They trying to sabotage her tour. Basically, some people that got fired that previously worked for her, prior management. Blah, okay. Nonetheless, what y'all think about this? Do y'all think Nikki bugging out? Or you do you think there's some truth to what she might be saying as far as niggas trying to sabotage her situation or her tour that's going on right now? Could be. Can I start off? But yeah, yeah. yo, this is cut the cap. And I don't give a fuck if I meet Nikki or not. I don't like her attitude. The way she treat people mm. is nasty. The way she treat her treat her staff is disgusting on camera, off camera. And and the energy you put out is the energy you gonna get back wherever you go. So if that happened, that happened for a reason. You know what I'm saying? This this like you see videos left to right where she don't know she on camera and she just like the one she wild out on her on her stylist. Like yo, it be she 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 too much sometimes, man. That that control shit, like it get the it get the bigger the how you said it the better people. Yeah, the like, better. You gotta yeah. be you gotta be you gotta be human at all times, man. Treat people like humans and don't get mad when shit happen to you. Ain't nobody try to stop your tour. That's God telling you to chill the fuck out. And I hope she see this shit too. Chill the fuck out. Start treating people with respect, man. Now let me ask you this though, killer, because this did it happened in Amsterdam. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying we know. Weed is legal. You yeah. know what I'm saying in Amsterdam. I'm pretty you know what I'm saying? So and her security guard, I believe, also claimed it was his. Mm -hmm. So Yeah. Do you think there might be a little more to the story? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be honest. I don't give a fuck if it was. Somebody <laughs> need to slow her ass down, bro. She too big headed. She too beyond herself. Slow her ass down. Maybe she needed five hours in that jail cell to sit there and realize though you you can't control everything, bro. Like nah, the, everything happened for a reason. Now, if it, it I, I, I hear what you're saying, Wolf. Well, and of course, you think I'm being funny. I'm being dead ass, bro. Slow the fuck down, man. Like I don't, I, I can't, bro. She need that shit. Okay. I got a different take on that. I think first of first thing I want to say, y'all need to chill out with this weed overseas shit. It's not the states, not everybody legalizing that shit. So I don't care if it's somebody in your camp or you chill out with that shit. Second of all, it could very well be. Um, what she's saying because of exactly what strategic is saying she is nasty um well i i, I don't i can't say nasty because I, I haven't experienced it but from rumors is that she doesn't treat her staff well and there's been plenty of people to come out stylists being in one in particular that have said that, you know you know they talked to her like garbage didn't want to do they had money issues and all types of other weird issues so i could very well see somebody like oh really you in my country and all right. And then, you know, in a lot of other countries, they work together. Like, it don't matter if the cops are with, oh, okay, let's go scoop up. Weed is legal, but we still gonna lock her behind up. We're not going to keep her, but we're going to throw in and I meant to say that part five. Yeah. She's going to miss her show. You know what I mean? You know, we ain't got nothing on her, but we might throw her in there just for a little bit. And then, you know, and then that, of course, whatever else happened and came out the security guard, said it was his or so on and so forth. But she's 41 years old. Like, she, she shouldn't this. This don't make no sense for her to be doing like going through this at this age at this this time of her life like she should be settled and, and kind of just in a groove like just be on tour and chilling you know what i'm saying like and then smoke when you get back home type shit. i don't know this is just crazy okay, okay. <clears throat> all right well i i, I wanted to say oh. yeah no nah, i got you right quick um, i just want to i'm saying let me uh just just some comments in the chat Q Smith said uh, they looked at it like even though it's legal in Amsterdam, it's still not legal on flights. Mm. Okay. 
Everybody love Chris. Uh, you have to know how to talk to people no matter how big you become. I mm -hmm. mean, son had that, that that killer touched on. Joseph said this shit cap. These relevant dope female MCs out here killing that tour. By the way, heroin is legal in Amsterdam. I don't know who said anything about heroin, Joseph. I'm <laughs> saying you need to relax. You got to relax. <laughs> and I took a trip out yeah, there. Crazy. Heroin is legal. It's crazy. But hold on. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't know that one. Yo, hold on. But you the, the, this saw I'm on point. You said this. What was the topic again? So I'm, uh, what was the question you asked us? So do do y'all think, you know, because she was saying basically that it was people trying to sabotage her tour. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, okay, okay. So, I, I, so yeah, yeah. Oh. I think she bugging out, or is mm -hmm. it? it no, I, I, yo, listen. I, actually, five hit it. He had a very good point. Whoa, whoa. The pause. No Diddy. No Diddy. No Diddy. It's crazy because five. Yo, no, he right though. Listen, I, I, a lot. Listen, it ain't just her. A lot of rappers throughout the years. We talking back in the day. They tend to take flights and go places and they sneak weed. I don't know why they do this. Right. Well, I kind of know why. We all know why. You know what I mean? They need their weed. They go to the Bahamas. Right, right. They go all over. It's a lot of stories in the industry of different artists who's been saved from different artists sneaking weed. Like Remy Ma, Method Man and Red Man ain't have weed in Bahamas and she was able to get a weed. I think happened with Tupac somewhere with another artist. So they need to stop that. Five is right. It ain't just her. It's it's for some reason people love taking chances with their freedom for some weed. I don't I don't get it. I don't know why. I'm not a smoker. I don't know what it is, but I have relatives too that do the same thing. They just gotta put in their bras when they coming back from Jamaica. They gotta put in yo, you can't fly places with weed on you. That's illegal. Mm. Point blank. That's so you point. yeah, you can't be mad when they lock you up for it ain't nobody trying to sabotage nothing you know what i mean and that happens so often we've lost artists because they tried to sneak uh what's his name um uh, uh my guy y'all know him uh the singer the the, the the juice juice world oh yeah it wasn't we but it's like i said these guys they these artists artists they love to try to sneak things private flights they sneak something on there with them etc so that's what my yeah that's mean? what no, yeah, I mean, that's that. Yeah, M and Joseph, out, where you see her one of the legal in Amsterdam? I'm, I'm pointed that out too. She said they, they stupid this, we did buy it there, leave it home. Right, you know? that's a fact. No, did I'm she get caught leaving or did she get caught coming? Coming. Yeah. Oh, and, and the last point too. That's another scenario that I'm sure people get tired of hearing. Like these different places, like yo, it's my security. Yeah. Everybody uses that line. Every artist, yeah. every yo, my security, it's my security gun. It's just, it ain't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. And, and nine times out of ten, you know, majority of times they don't Somebody care about none of that ball. shit. Yeah, but even if they do, like majority of the times they don't care about none of that. They going for you because they know yeah. you're the. You know what I'm saying you're the the star, so they're gonna make an example out of you. you know what I'm saying, but you know, like, and. and to go along with what y'all said, know what I'm saying? After we seen shit, like, you know what happened to Brittany Griner, know what I'm saying? Over it's some simple lesson. shit, know what I mean? Which wasn't even weed. It was, what was it? Was it, it a CBD? It was, a it, was a, it was a vape. It had weed in it, but it was a liquid, okay. I think. Yeah, but liquid. nonetheless, know what I'm saying? You would think that, you know, people, know what I'm saying? Let's get this clear, y'all. Even though weed is legal, weed is legal in certain places. Every law is not the same everywhere that you go. Know what I'm saying. Well, to, to clarify that, wall, that follow different laws. Yeah, to clarify that, well, weed is legal statewide, not federal, which yeah, is why you can't fly federal. with it. Yep. Yeah, so it don't matter yeah. which you could be flying from two states that that are legal. You can smoke Once weed legally, air, but done. if you in the air, that's federal jurisdiction. You can get no, no. But up. what I'm saying is, yeah, yeah. But what I'm saying is, countries. There's different countries that they, you know, like I know. What is it? Uh, Yo, Jamaica. It's not even a fucking law. They only got a law mm -hmm. for it. It's like yeah. when you go around Jamaica and you got weed. They like, well, it ain't no law for it. We do it. Yeah, but, it's but like, you just that plane. What does it's that federal mean, now. bro? Can I yeah, yeah, it 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 Can I not? Look, it, it isn't like like um. Saudi Arabia, son, like they don't even allow that shit at all. Like if they, they don't allow nothing shit, out like, there. That's yeah, completely different. You can't touch a girl out there. Yeah, yeah no PDA out there. On some real shit, so yeah, you can't even give a hug or kiss to out there. To be clear, you up. can't take it on the plane, yeah, Joseph. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? so that's a fact, uh, James. 
you would be forgotten. James, that motherfucker. James said people got locked up in other places. Have to understand, you will be forgotten in the jail cell for a longer time. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. They don't follow the same rules at all. We we we've seen that happen before. <laughs> I mean, unless you're in Mexico, then you could probably buy your way out. 